Morning guys, what's going on? We're just watching a bit of sprint kayaking on telly. And there they go. There's Ed, Ed Rutherford and Johnny Boyton. There they go. The boys are in um, Hungary racing at a place called Zeged, which is um, a really nice place to race actually. Hungarians love paddling, so there's always a big crowd. Yeah, they were up there for most of it. Still a long season, so Boyton and Rutherford, I'm sure, have got a lot more planning and preparation to do before their main events because this is just a World Cup. But they did really well to be in the A final. family outing to Giro. Mum and Dad have taken Alfie there already. I'm just trailing behind. I've gone in a separate car because I need to do other stuff as well. And Mum and Dad are going to take Alfie for a walk. It's not the warmest day. The weather could be better. <laughs> Alfie, are you sniffing around my coffee? Are you sniffing around my coffee, boy? Hey, family outing to Giro. Cheers, Mum. Yes. Cheers, Dad. Cheers, Alf Dog. Cheers, Alf Dog. <laughs> <laughs> nice, healthy breakfast today. Alfie wants some of it, by looks of things. Right, that was a nice little quick breakfast and quaffy in Giro. Now I've got to go home and do a quick bit of work. And then I'm meeting up with my mate that I haven't seen in ages, uh, Sophie, in Walton. We're going to have a bit of lunch. And then I feel like I'm going to do a run later, down the river again. Maybe do another 10k, see how it goes. Right, pop time, got a little bit of work done. Not much though, and now I'm heading straight out to Walton again. Um, but last night, I just randomly tweeted that I really want to go and do a helicopter tour of London to like get some good Instagrams and just because it'll be fun. And then, and Steve posted a, an Instagram of being in a helicopter. He's in Monaco at the moment, watching the Grand Prix. And oh, that'd be so cool. I hope he's making a video out of that. I'm sure he is. Guys, I want you to meet Sophie. How's it going? You alright? <laughs> I haven't seen Sophie in years. We've got a lot to catch up on. A lot to catch up on. Um, but first, we need to select something really nice to eat. I'm gonna go for the Thai chicken wrap. What are you gonna have? I'm sort of like got a craving for a tuna burger. I changed my mind and went for the croque monsieur. I copied Sophie actually. She's pretty good with food. <laughs> Flowers, fantastic food as always. Now I'm in Sophie going for a mooch. A bit of a retail mooch. Not that Walton's got much to offer, but they've, they've got a paper chase. They do have paper chase, I haven't learned it in ages. Go buy some paper. I actually need to buy paper, that's the sad thing. Right, that's a nice little catch up with Soph. Um, and now we're both going to head back to mine, and she wants to meet Alfie. That's his little cotton bags. Come here, wait. Come, 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 come down. Come down. You did get a bit better at going downstairs last week. Oh no. Oh no, oh. back up. Bye, Soph. Bye. 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 Bye
Nice cat. Oh, uh, see you around. See you around. <laughs> Alfie, get her, get her. <laughs> Say goodbye nicely. Say goodbye nicely. Bye. Oh, fluff ball of destiny. Alright, guys, I have completed my uh, Costa Rica blog post. A bit of writing and a bunch of images. So if you're interested in that, go and check it out. Right, Brogans. Um, I'm going for a run. My edit's just gone out a little bit late, but I've been doing a lot today. I've got that Contiki um, blog post out finally. That took forever because I wasn't happy with the photos. So I had to re edit. Anyway, I'm going to go for a run. <laughs> Oh, watch it! Right guys, thanks to Zane Lo, I'm sufficiently hyped up for my run, so I'll see you in a bit. I'm gonna try and do 10K again. Let's do this! Well, I managed another 10 kilometers, which is good. And I did it about two or three minutes quicker than last time. Still going really steady. Didn't feel quite as uh, energetic as last time because I don't think I had enough water to drink today. And also last time I was super amped because um, I just found out Nicole is gonna come and visit. But I got a couple of weeks yet until she's here. So I'm like getting shape, you know, before, before she gets here. Um, yeah, legs feel good, um, yeah, just feeling really like that nice feeling you get after exercise. Sun's going down, oh, it's pretty much gone down, got a nice little reflection on the River Thames there, very nice. Now I must go home and eat, get a relatively early night. And uh, yeah, this week I've got a couple of interesting things that I'm doing. Again, a couple of meetings, but I'm not heading up to London quite as much um, as I thought I was going to. So yeah, I think it's gonna, by the time you guys see this, it's gonna be about, it's just over two weeks before Nicole comes over, um, which is gonna be awesome. I can't wait to show her all around London. Mum and Dad are having a romantic Saturday night in. Watching Frozen. Good movie. Nice healthy dinner tonight. Rice noodles, stir fry veg, and some salmon. All right, my furry little internet family. Um, I'm gonna hit the hay now, I'm gonna go to bed. Because it's early, it's like not even 11 o'clock yet. Normally I'm not in bed till like 12. And then the puppy wakes me up at five and then I edit for an hour, five till six, and then I fall asleep till nine. Weird sleeping patterns at the moment. Um, so I'm gonna try and break out of those. Um, yeah, it's been a good day. Um, I'll catch you tomorrow. The puppy's not gonna be sleeping very well tonight. Shame, man. I think he might be sleeping on my pillow tonight. Anyway, I'll catch you tomorrow. Remember to work hard, be nice to people, try not to get lost or killed. Okay, I love you, bye. Of course, I'm gonna go for this shirt. What do you think, light blue? I like it.